DJI gave us one of the biggest firmwares of all time. Let's talk about it. What is up guys, California Phantom here to talk about the exciting new firmware update from DJI. This affects all Mavic 3 models, so if you got the old Cine model, the old original dual lens, the Pro, or the Classic, it's going to apply to all of them. And is yet another feather in my opinion to choose at the very least the Mavic 3 Classic over the uh, Air 3. They dynamic home points, it's uh, something they may call it differently. But when you have a whole point that dynamically changes based on where you are in relative space, I call it dynamic home point. But basically DJI has added the feature that already existed in the Mavic 3 Enterprise and updated the app so that the Mavic 3 drone can have a dynamic moving home point. And what that basically means is wherever you take off from, relative to where the drone actually is and the camera's pointing, you'll be able to see your home point in real time uh, through the main camera. Why this is such an important feature to add to the DJI system is its ease of use. So uh, I don't know about you, but when I plan my return to home, I'm either looking for relative to where I'm at, uh, I orientate myself based on what I am on the screen, or at most, I look in the lower left hand corner and I look for that red line of sight uh, line that lets me know uh, where the drone is and where the home point is and I can fall that back safely no matter low light, no light, or, or in daytime. The fact that we now have a dynamic home point, it's something we can easily pick up visually. We're already using the FPV main camera for the filming aspect of it. All you need to do is orientate your drone in the right direction and instantly pick up on the home point. Really, it's a feature that all of DJI drones should have and maybe they will in the future, but I'm very glad that they've added to the Mavic 3 platform. It makes my job a lot easier. Moving right along to the stunner, the shock and awe was the what they did with the obstacle avoidance. It's a feature that I never could have imagined coming back from the uh, Phantom 2 Vision days. Um, where by DJI has essentially converted all of the obstacle avoidance sensors that once was just purely a sensor now into operational cameras. And what that gives you is a 360 look around your drone no matter what direction you're operating in. If you're pulling the stick to the right, your drone's going to the right doing an orbit shot, it'll automatically in that lower left hand uh, menu or that lower left hand screen will show you the right hand side obstacle avoidance making strikes that much more difficult to achieve. I have recently done some orbit shots between trees for a commercial property that I would have probably not even considered uh, doing but having the obstacle avoidance sensors having the cameras available to me I was felt a lot more confident to thread the needle and to get shots that I wouldn't ordinarily, ordinarily get given the new features of these obstacle avoidance sensors. So given this major update by DJI with the Mavic 3 platform and the relative close price point of the, Ma the Air 3 to the Mavic 3 Classic, I don't see a point uh, given this situation why anyone wouldn't buy a Mavic 3 Classic over an Air 3 unit. Unless you're scrimping and scraping and you barely can afford that Air 3, the Mavic 3 Classic is a, bear, is a far better platform to use, especially given this update. You're getting a Micro Four Thirds sensor, you're getting outstanding footage, you're getting incredible stills. It's something now that I employ uh, between the Classic and the Pro on all of my commercial sites, almost, I would say 90% of all my commercial work now is on the Mavic 3 platform. And uh, that's pretty much it guys. I hope you enjoyed this uh, little video. Are you excited? Are you guys that already own Mavic 3s uh, enjoying this new update? I know I am shocked by DJI as I, as I said from the beginning. They usually give us nothing but this is probably in my opinion the single greatest firmware update we've ever seen from DJI. We'll catch you on the next adventure.